hey everyone and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to save a project for instagram reels let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in CapCut, i want you to click the sign up option from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go now to save a project in CapCut PC for Instagram Reels, you'll need to ensure that your project is in the correct aspect ratio and resolution, and of course, export it in a compatible format. So once you open the CapCut PC, I want you to click the create a new project if you want to begin your work and start from scratch. But if you have already an existing project, just click on it to begin editing. Now I'm working with this specific file right here. And I wanted to make sure that this is in the aspect ratio for Instagram Reels. How would you know what is the correct aspect ratio for Instagram Reels? All you have to do is go here. It doesn't say it's an aspect ratio, but if you click this numbers and values, you would notice that if you click on it, there should be an options here. All right, 16 by 19, which is kind of like a landscape orientation. 4 by 3 is like a square. This one is like a rectangle, like for a link in banner. But as you can see, the 9 to 16 is the Instagram requirement for a vertical video. All right, so we are on the right spot. But if your video is not in this aspect ratio, just click on it to make sure that it's converted to the aspect ratio required for Instagram Reels. Now, you want to make sure that your video is cohesive enough for a very amazing and engaging instagram reels once you're happy with the edits and transitions and effects all right i want you to click on the export button on the top right corner a new dialog box will appear and from here you would notice that you have an option to export it to different file location or directory if you want to change it but if you don't it's okay now for the resolution you want to make sure that you don't use 4k if your video is not in 4k format if you know what i mean if that makes sense because for example your video is low quality like 720 if you click on the 4k it doesn't magically gonna recreate your video into a 4k quality so stick to the uh, actual quality of your video in my case 1080 is okay for an uh, instagram reel for the bitrate just um make sure it's higher all right decode it just leave it as it is for now if you're not really expert with the uh different file formats and then for the uh, format i don't necessarily suggest mov but i highly suggest mp4 because it's one of the universally accepted file formats for uploading in the internet all right for the frame rate if your video was in 60 frames just select the 60 frames or 60 fps but in my case my video was taken at 30 fps so i'm gonna stick with it all right if you want to turn on the optical flow to all clips you can do that but it requires a pro subscription and of course you can also integrate the audio if you want once you are happy with it just click this section right here and click the export button and after that you want to make sure that you upload it to your instagram account and basically that's how you save your project in CapCut pc to instagram reels thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next video